everybody, we're in Hobby Lobby again today, and it is a day off, so this will be an extended video for you. But I thought we'd stop in the beat section. I just saw some of the cutest things I've ever seen. These are so adorable. That's pretty too. Wow, those are so cool. Oh, you've got ladybugs. That is really neat. That one is extremely gorgeous. It is a hamburger. Hamburger and french fries. Oh, that's kind of cool too. Watermelons. Those are pretty interesting. Hmm. Those are really cool too. Oh, that one's really cool. Right, pretty. Wow, they have a totally new meat section right now. Ooh, got your gold nuggets. Oh, check that. These are some sparkly. Got your little beds. These are like lava rocks. That's really cool. That's neat. See, I could do something like this. Oh, excuse me. See, I could do something like this. I just need to find the time to get her done. They are considering taking us off of 12 hour days at work now because everybody has just been uh, com not complaining. But we're all worn out, and we've kind of let it be known. So we have also let them know that we would prefer to do maybe a normal day, like six or eight hours. That might be cool. I mean, the 12 hours were awesome because we got it done in three days or so. And then you had an extra Saturday. We all alternate Saturdays with the girls up front. Um, but we have all come to realize that our bodies do not want to agree with our minds just get it done and over with. So hopefully we will be going down to some sort of reasonably reasonable hour lich, if that's what you want to call it. So that might just need more time for other things. Here forever in this section. They're so pretty. That is just so regal. That is such a pretty regal color. Very interesting. That's so pretty. 
all the colors. Oh my god, so many awesome colors. Little piggies. That's adorable. Okay, that's cool too. I like that. Oh, good image. Image over here. More pearly type looking things. These are all glass beads. Oh, these are so pretty. Those colors are awesome. Those are cool as well. I actually have one of these, and I was really into it. And actually getting things done. Oh, this is kind of cool too. Bead tower. And then here's all your crimping tools and your tortoises. Oh, look at this one. Now, what kind of nonsense is that? Multiple. That's cool. That's your sizer. That's really cool, too. Don't ask me why it's cool. I just like the way it looks. <laughs> Bead containers. This looks just like a medical tumbler. Your bracelet to make it. All your storage pieces. Got your little baby bottles, your big bottles, plastic containers, mediums. Yes. All the jewelry that you do make. Ooh, okay, I've not seen this before. That's cool. Oh, this is really cool. This is an endless loom. I like that. I like that idea. You're not limited. Jewelry storage or displays. We have all your locket type things that you can make and put things in. branches and branches and branches that I was stripping and um, painting and shellacking or whatever you want to call it um, for walking sticks and I just got rid of a bunch because I was getting behind in them 
and didn't want them to attract things into the garage. Um, if I had known, I could have chopped them up into little pieces and sold them. And these are resin mixing cups. These are your tinted resins, it looks like. And then we have a big kitty sell little oils. And then we have the amber vials. That's kind of cool. Oh, look at these. Those are really awesome. I love those. That's so pretty. And then you've got your clears. A couple of different shapes. Okay, that's pretty cool. I really, for some reason, keep getting drawn back to this one. coming down the aisle, so I'm just going to keep moving along here, see you in a little bit. Um, the toy, whatever section you want to call this, I could have so much fun with this. I love Play-Doh. I've got several videos up of me squishing stuff through the presses. If you want to check those out, I can link them above. Or you can just go to my videos and find them. Find the time. Like I said before, we are probably going to be cutting our hours, not not back, but to half days rather than 12-hour days. So that might just give me some more time for real life and living. So I'm in the wood aisle, and I just love this aisle. I love the smell of wood. My dad was a carpenter, so it's just the smell I grew up with. Oh, that's pretty. So cool, so cool. So many crafty, handy things to do. Oh, that's a really cool little keepsake box, if you will. And, all right, everybody, we'll see what else we get into here. Um, on the other side of the aisle is all uh, some plastic. These are so adorable. I really like. Again, things you can keep safe, you know, put things in. Uh, little pots of carry jars, if you will. We've got them also with the uh, erase or the chalkboard, excuse me. And look, oh my gosh, we've got some more clearance, everyone. $3.99. Oh, 99 cents for that one. $5.99 for that one. But I just love the beaker type looking thing here. I love it around Halloween time when they actually have the beakers out the um, the chemistry type looking ones. If you know what I'm trying to say, sometimes words just elude me. All right, I think we've got one more clearance section to hit, and we'll see what's doing over there. Alrighty, the other clearance section was nothing to write home about. And then I did find this aisle of 75% off. Um, so I'm just going to mosey on through here. But I am probably going to say bye bye for now, folks. Ooh. Okay, that's awesome. I can do this. Why? Why? <laughs> Why is it you see everything and you go, oh, I can do that? Do you ever do it, buddy? Getting a little loud on the other aisle there. So I am going to say goodbye. And we will see you in the next video. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.